Tumagasa, everyone. It's uh, me, Charlie Ferret. Oh. There we go. And we're playing Mother 3 today. Yay! I love this game so much. Alright, let me just, uh. Um. There we go. Come on. That's. Oh. That works for me too. <laughs> Poor Lucas. Flint. And. Oh, nope. I don't know how to pronounce it. I want to say Hen uh, Hen Awa. I'm I'm bad at names. <laughs> and I'll just leave this one as default. I was gonna I was gonna call it Old Spice, but eh, why not? <laughs> uh, well, my favorite homemade food is meat. I just misspelled that, didn't I? Great, now everyone knows I can't spell. All this has been a giant ruse. You can, <laughs> you can now see why I cannot word right. Uh, come on, you can do it. There we go. Oh, my favorite thing is love. And once again, all caps, because why not? Uh, I should I should have started after this. Oh no! Well, you guys are gonna have to see me name Duster and Kumatora too. But I'm just gonna leave the names like that. Uh, let's see what we got. Um. Oh, there. Mint, strawberry. Ooh, I like strawberry. Banana, peanut, grape. I don't know, we're going strawberry. Yeah. <laughs> um, I think medium should be alright for me. This is perfect. Actually, in reality, I really don't like dogs that much. Oh, here we go. Welcome to the world of Mother 3. Oh, I love this game, so excited. Oh, so many good memories. If you guys don't know what this game is, shame on you. If you ever played Super Smash Bros. Brawl, this is where Lucas came from. Oh, oh, I'm so happy. I love this game, Nowhere Islands. <laughs> yeah. Um, for a warning, though. I was talking to Raph a little bit earlier, and I told him how I lost my save so many times on this game. Tazami Village. And if I lose my save data on here, I'm going to lose my mind. So just be warned, if that happens, I, I will cheat. I have every, I reserve every right to cheat. I may not. You know, I, I won't do anything crazy. I'll just give myself a very good weapon. That's that's it. That's all I want. I reserve that right. You know, Raph was telling me that you know, if I want to be a professional, I shouldn't cheat, and you know, cheaters never win. Home of Alec, I want his father. Eh, knock knock. Oh, I'm so happy. Oh, there's Lucas. He's asleep. Come on, wake up, you little sod. Lucas, how long are you going to nap? Shut up, Klaus. I'm sleeping. Get up so we can play. Get up already. The Dragos brought their babies over. They're really cute. Hurry up. Shut up, Klaus. Oh. Liz is not going to say that. Liz is not going to like that. No problem here. Oh, man. I love this game. A wood burning stove. A real wood burning stove. I like those fake ones. <laughs> Same bedhead as always. That, just like me. Except I'm not blonde. I have brown hair. Oh, look, there's my mom. Good morning, Mr. Sleepyhead Lucas. 
Well, not my mom. My mom's asleep. So is my dad. But I call him Haas. <laughs> Klaus has been up for a while playing with Dragos. Alright, well, I guess I'm gonna walk out. Are well, you planning to play in your pajamas? Yes, I am. Scoot on upstairs and change your clothes. Alright, Mom, I'll do it. Oh, man, I'm sorry, guys. I'm sorry I'm looting out. I just really love this game. Oh, my heart's all pounding. Like, I decided to do it out of the blue today. Can I, can I run? Uh, uh, oh, I can't run the house. I'll bust my head open, wouldn't I? Alright. Oh, look, there's a grandpa and a cow. And a pig. And a chicken. And another chicken. Ark. Wait. Oh, that's how I do it. That's. I'm dumb. I'm gonna go right in the house. Yee. Oh. <laughs> oh, she surrenders. Oh, I got some bread. Huh. <laughs> oh. Hey, one more time. Go on, run for the road. All right, fine. Oh, I can't bump into him. I have sleep head. Oh, well, today's the day you head back home. I'm gonna miss you guys. Come on, look in this trash can. You can't stop me. Um, trash can? Okay. Talk to the cow. <laughs> All cows matter what they're thinking. Go moo. It'd be handy to remember that. <laughs> um. Okay, well, we're going to have to investigate this. <laughs> oh, oh, dear. Oh, oh I'm, so, I'm sorry. Right, let's go talk to the chickens. Oh, I just booed that chicken, didn't I? No. You lower it. You, you, oh, you late riser. See, I was in joke. Come on, chicken, I want to talk to you. Alright. I'm gonna go down here. There's ants at your feet. You might have standing step on them, so please don't continue this. That's one of the reasons why I love this game. It is just so. It's hard to explain. Oh, you look a frog. I'm gonna go talk to the frog. <laughs> Stories. A story is a series of memories. Memories are remembered with other memories. And turn becomes memories themselves. That's deep for a frog. And I say that. <laughs> if you don't take care to preserve your memories, you'll forget them. So please tell us your memories of everything so far. That's <laughs> what people refer to as saving. Now then, hop, save your game? Yes. Um. Uh. Oh dear. Uh, oh no. Um. Um. Well, we have a problem. <laughs> well, I wasn't really joking about that cheating thing, now was I? Luckily, you know, I was a safe state and all that. <laughs> oh, look at the baby Drago. It's all derpy looking and cute. Huff, yeah, it's pretty I'm beat. I've been play fighting with dragos all morning. You can play too, Lucas. Sure. Try ramming into the, a drago. Klaus, Lucas still has I I know how I know how grandpa old man. Yeah. Yeah, I know about the B button. The B button's in my mind, I know. B stands for B as in for bash. Yeah, uh huh. Um. Oh, you little jerk. I ran to mom. Alright. You'll never succeed with a sullen look on your face. 
<laughs> that holds true for anything, just relax. Now, <laughs> this is what I did on my first time when I first played it. I ran, did this, did that, didn't know how to control it, it ran right into her. I completely missed the target somehow. Hey. <laughs> Uh, that's, also, that's so nice. I love this game. That's uh, nope. Uh, you just make a sound. We probably can't hear that. Oh, here you go. This. I'm gonna hit you. Oh. All right. Whoa. All right. So I guess we can't do anything else. So, Drago. I wonder what a Drago is. I'm gonna wander down here. Yeah, you know, I'll fall off a cliff or something. Uh, okay. <laughs> that was a delayed reaction. Yeah, let's talk to Klaus. The harder you run, the more the Dragos like it. Um, <laughs> move it out of the way. Make ready for the Great Mole Cricket. <laughs> I just can't sit idly by when I hear someone play fighting. I'm going to wipe the floor with all of you. Get my way, I'll be in a world of pain. And this is one of the reasons why I love it. Look, we're fighting a mole cricket for no reason. Now, this game actually has a, uh... This interesting, uh, fighting song where you have to... Oh, you cute. Where you have to. Uh, sorry, guys, I got tongue tied. The fighting style is you have to time your hits properly, which is going to be hard since I can't hear it. Oh well. <laughs> I see you have more of a spine than I thought. You like to train? I, I could train you personally sometime. Next time we meet, I'll be a big mole crazy. Well. It'll be at the big mole cr uh, cricket well, the, the stadium. I can't talk. <laughs> I look forward to see you there, bro. He called me a bro. Oh, he ran into something. Oh, that's right. Hirana <laughs> winged him with a shoe. I stepped on a mole cricket. Hope it's alright. She's a nice mom. Lunch is ready, everybody. Make <laughs> your favorite boys meet. I'm so excited. <laughs> I completely forgot I had this on here. My buddy Raf sent me a copy of this because I was talking about how I don't have the translated version and I can't get it no more. He's like, oh, here you go. I've, I've got to read that, guys. I'm sorry. You too, Dad. Oh, man, he has a nice old jaunty rock there. Now then. Um, okay. Oh, here's how to save. Oh, that's probably the right reason I can't save. Talk to frogs. <laughs> how do you save? Listen to him, everybody. If you're lost in the, word, the woods and about to die, talk to our frog. You'll respawn there. Not really. <laughs> it's too, yeah, blah, blah, blah. Play saving is absolutely free. And I thought I was cheap. I am cheap. When it comes to myself, I'm cheap. But if I'm like, I'm doing something for a friend, I go all out. Of course, I have no money now. It's time for me to return to the story. <laughs> One of the great reasons about this game, they just break the fourth wall. It is just completely funny. It's also really sad. I <laughs> it's hard for a game and a movie to make me cry. This is one of the games I actually have. So, later on in episodes, I'm, you may hear me holding back manly tears? <laughs> What's your favorite food, Mom? Oh, meat? Then your favorite is the same as ours. <laughs> you make a good match. After we're done eating, we need to get ready to go home. We'll have to go through the forest to get back, so we'll, leave, so we'll need to leave early. Mmm, man. I can't say for those people who haven't seen it yet. Don't be silly. I bet the kids could make it on their own. It's that safe. 
I bet even you can handle it, Lucas. Ha 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 ha. Because, no, Lucas is the coddled baby of a family. That's what I was when I was a kid. <laughs> it's true. I'm hoping to get the first part of it done. Dear Flint, just like you said, uh, they would. Blah. Just like you said they would, the children have been running around the mountains and fields tirelessly since the moment we arrived. <laughs> Klaus is daring and full of energy, as ever. Lucas is still a bit coddled, but neither one seems to be tired of playing at all. My father seems to seem sad to say goodbye to his grandchildren after seeing them for the first time a long, a long show ago. Oh no, I can't read that fast. <laughs> But we should be home by this evening. I've forgotten how nice. Oh man, refreshing mountain air is. You always covered in the heap of snow. Oh man, I'm sorry, guys. I tried. Next time we visit, I'll ask one of our neighbors to tend the sheep so we can all come here as a family. Klaus, Lucas, and I were always thinking of you, and we've got. Once we get home this morning, I'll start eating some of our favorite meat right away. With love, your dearest. Her name. I'm sorry guys, like I said, I'm bad at reading. I, I can read it in my head. I hate my tongue. <laughs> Hi, Faye. Where'd you get that bird? Well, there's a trouble brewing. When I played, I, a lot of people don't know this. But when I played this game, I was in a very dark place. I was going through, like, just the worst time. You know, I was recently broken up. I developed sciatica, which is the worst pain imaginable, I believe, in my opinion. I could be wrong. And just everything went to crap fast. Now... Um, by the three, but this game is one of the one of the few things that got me to smile again, which is odd because of how this game does get depressing. Bomb, that yeah. Oh, I was saying boom. Yeah, yeah. I'm great at reading. Boom. <laughs> There's a lighter and fuel. Unfortunate names and seeing the play's about to catch fire. Not really a spoiler because we're about to go into that. Oh man, look at that. It's a caribou. Oh, and there they are. The pork soldiers or whatever they're called. But they're kind of like a mixture of. Well, actually, they're pretty much a mixture of stormtroopers and Nazis. Oh, man. <laughs> Thomas. Uh, and I don't ask me to name them all. They all have names. Oh, I know that's Bronson, because you might as well be Charles Bronson. <laughs> Chapter 1 Night at a Funeral. Yeah. Uh, take that hint, everyone. Things about to get sad. Fast. <laughs> Flint! 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 It's a fire! A fire! A fire! The Sunshine Fort, well, that's also a fortunate name, is a fire and a huge fiery flaming fire. <laughs> And there's one of our main heroes, Flint. And he just gives zero craps. Look at that. <laughs> yes, we're going to take a quick nap. There's no emergency going on. We're just going to sleep. It should all sort itself out. No, I guess not. Uh, there we go. <laughs> you guys do something quick, Flint. I don't see. I don't see how he's the fireman. He's not. The force. The force. The force on fire. You don't need some water. Just let that mother. I'm sorry, guys. Jeez. Who would lock the door in a village as peaceful as ours? Flint. 
<laughs> ah, the doorknob. He ripped the doorknob out. Why well, have to come up at a time like this? That doorknob, by the way, is a running gag. <laughs> the doorknob, I mean Flint. There's no time to be dozing off. There's a huge fire in the Sunshine Forest. Bad times like this call for reckless, reckless nice guys like you. Please, come on, Flint. Please? Yeah. Tom has joined the party. I don't get what he'll do. He'll just flail his arms a bit. I'll fall behind you. Well, what's wrong with that? You're going to be looking at my butt. I happen to like falling to Oh, man. I was just joking about that. Come on, Booney. Give me the stick. I'm going to need this. I got a stick. Hey, Flint. That stick will make a good weapon in case anything happens. Be sure to grip it, though. Just hold it. Yeah, blah, blah, blah. We know this. Well, I know this. You guys probably don't. Wait, you got a stick now. I'm going to hit things with a stick. You know what? I just realized this running animation. I love it. Oh. Oh. Yes. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Well. Um. Looks like we're going to have to. Oh, no. Oh no. I'm sorry guys, that just kinda kinda bums me out. Ooh, present. Fill up the present. I got some nut bread. I'm not making that joke. Yet. I roll in the future. Hey look. I'm gonna talk to this guy, Biff. Ah, Flint. The whole north sky is pitch black with smoke. Oh dear. Eh, we don't got time to talk to people. Oh, wait, we can talk to Mapson. We'll talk to him. He's a... I don't know. Oh, no. Here we go. If you need something from a map-loving and map-owning Mapson, it must be a map, yes? Please feel free to take one with you. Yay! Uh-huh. Yeah, well, yeah. Cool. Yeah, uh-huh. Um, I kind of know it, bud. Um, uh, oh, there you go. So, we'll need to go north. I don't know about saying we go east. I'm horrible. Woo! Hey, what's over here real quick? Oh, hey, Tall Tower! Hey, <laughs> Lender, can't. Uh, Ladir, can you see the fire from there? I say, I said. Uh, he's uh, talkative as ever. Good old Tall Tower. He's our friend. Uh, we'll go here real quick. Hey, the forest of, and the people and the animals all have happiness. Um, this isn't happy happyism, is it? That was in the last game, and ooh. Oh, Flynn, good to see you here. Things only proper to offer a prayer here before going into the forest. I believe that is a good idea. Please answer with a calm mind. Please tell me your name. Yes, yeah, the name of the person playing the game. Well, everyone just calls me Charlie. But you could call me Charlie Ferret if you want. That's that is my YouTube handle. Hey, can I fit that? Oh, let's try. Come on, everyone, put your minds into it. We all know I can't read or count. Hooray! Hey, you know what? Just because I'm happy, we're gonna put. It. There you go. That's how happy I am. Understood. Fairly ferret. Yeah, yeah, that's perfectly correct. 
Okay, then, please continue to enjoy the game. If I count down from three, you'll forget every you were ever asked this question. Three, two, one. If you on? No. You must forget. Um. Okay. Oh man, I hope I could be able to save somehow. I mean, I know I could do a save state, but I, I just don't want to go on horribly wrong again. Have to cheat. Oh, the fire's in this way. Oh, I said go north. Well, it's been a while. Oh, that's definitely not the way. Um. Um. Oh, okay. I, I got you. I, I guess I could have read that signpost or asked Tall Tower. He only talks to me. He tells me horrible secrets. Um, where's the fire? Is it? <coughs> Sorry, one. Uh, oh, I bet it's a big, giant, foresty fire. You little sod. Friend, thanks. Thank heavens you're here. I think Lady and Phil are stuck inside the forest. Don't worry, I'll hold back these rubbernecks. You just hurry in and find them. That is a good thing to hold them back because they're probably not well equipped. I'm well equipped because I'm Flint. Flint can handle anything. What about you? Hey, it's Mike. It's my brother. Cough, cough. Oh, he has asthma. Oh, <laughs> it's you, Flint. I thought I saw someone as manly as me walking this way. Oh, uh, never mind. This guy's me. This smoke is terrible with my sensitive throat. Uh, <laughs> wait, uh, I can't touch that one. I can't continue any further. So, can you have this cookie instead? Yay! Well, let this slightly unclean and not very tasty cookie be of use. Please, let it be of use. Oh, I got a nut cookie. I'm still not touching that one. Yet. I got a joke in the works. Don't worry, guys. You know, I... I you'll, you'll see. Oh. <coughs> Mr. Bay, block the way. Raph, why are you blocking the way? <laughs> Mr. Bay says the situation. Raph? Oh, well, Mr. Bay felt a little strange. Thomas is sounding a siren. Oh, man. <laughs> Thomas waving the surface forehead. Uh, come on, man. There we go. <laughs> Mr. Bay became tame. Yay! You won. A winner is you. Trying experience points. Woohoo! There are poisonous snakes. Uh, there should be antidotes around here. Mr. Bay blocked the way. Raph, no! Oh, he became friendly and affectionate. Too bad I'm going to have to hit him with a stick. My body solidified. I'm going to have to ask Raph if he knows that move. Oh dear. Um. Uh. It's feeling a little strange. Come on. There you go. So, hey guys, I'm just going to say that he's saying funny stuff. Mr. Bay became tame. Turning XP. The enemy left the present. Inside the present with some nut bread. Raph, why did you give me a nut bread? That was the joke I was working up to, everyone. That's all I have. Alright, luckily I do remember some things. Uh, there's a mouth and nap room. But we're going to go to the hot springs real quick to get relaxed. Get my back, Thomas. That's good. Oh man! <clears throat> All right, what's what's your deal, Matt? Where can Isaac be? Um, <laughs> if I recall correctly, he's being binded. Ooh, an Aries bracelet. 
I was awarded for my pun, and I don't like that game, so... <laughs> yeah. Hey, right, good. I'm an Aries. I take things as challenges. A lot. Man, they blocked the way. We got him with a stick. Friends and repeat. Hey, that's good. Thomas is wiping sweat from his forehead. Mr. Batty attacks. I'm sorry, guys. I'm, I just like to read. Kinda. Yeah, is this guy dead? Oh, is this Bronson? Oh, Flint. <laughs> cough, cough. Gah, I've breathed in too much smoke. Lighter in the sun, I so ba aren't back yet. I'm pretty sure they're stuck inside the forest. Cough, cough. Don't worry about me. Oh, no. Hire Kiko. Oh, no. Please, Kiko. Wait, oh, no. Oh, oh, no. Oh, we got hit. For all the, that is love... For the love of all that's holy, please keep that dog quiet. Please. Just for 30 more minutes. Hey, look! It's the pig suit Nazi guy. Oh, there he goes. Did he just burn himself? Metal box like objects is laying here. I'd be taking that. I, I would, I'd use that as a weapon. Oh, look, a yeah, monster. I'm gonna go fight it. I'm gonna go fight me a yam. You counted a yam monster. Oh, I, I'm bad at this. It's stirring the. Okay. <laughs> Thomas is ra running around restlessly. Yeah, there we go. There we go. That was easy. I'd be eating that. I think. Alright. You can sneak you can sneak up on the monsters. But you can't sneak up on these ones. They're mean. Uh. <laughs> I think Thomas probably would have the same reaction I'd be having. I like we had a real bad grease fire when I was younger. And I'm a tall guy. Uh, this thing was taller than me. It was horrible. It... Oh, we leveled up. Yay, I didn't pay attention. Oh, IQ right now by one. Yeah, we're leveled up now. It'll be even faster. That's right. Stick them. Stick them with a stick. Hooray! So we got this. We just have to save states and, you know, do stuff like that. Oh, yeah, that'll make sense. I'll save a state at the end of the episode next to a frog. Make things fair. All right, you monster. Yeah, monster. You monster. You monster. I'm sorry, guys. I ever told you guys that I'm not that funny? Yeah. <laughs> You guys already knew that, though, and that's why you love me. Oh, we left. Oh, oh. Some nut bread. Yay. My favorite. Alright. But, man, I love this game. Depressing as it is. Oh. Are you okay, buddy? You dead? No, you're not dead. It is that bug just beat you up. Ladder. Eh? Lighter. You alright? Flint. Oh, and Thomas. D damn it. Cough. I tried to beat these things up. More just kept coming. I can't get past them. Cough, cough. Uh huh. What is that thing? Bug? I think it's a bug. Cough, cough, don't know. They're going around the forest lighting fires. But <laughs> never mind that. Fuel's still at home. What? Fuel's still in your shack? Heh, <laughs> shanty. Flint, you go help fuel. I'll look after lighter. Like I said, a very unfortunate name. 
You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna eat a cookie. No, I'm gonna eat the bread that Raph gave me. Raph, give me your bread. How do I how do I get the bread? Um, did I get sleep? Status? Um uh, Oh, I I have to go to the goods. Um use Flint. There we go. Cause this is like a mini boss. You never seen a bug like this before. That's because it's a chimera. And they're mad. They're literally fireflies. I guess that one is dead. The other three aren't. A firefly and its cohort suddenly attacked. Firefly fired up and charged. Ah, oh, you little jerk. Oh no. Had breathed fire. Oh wow. That is a sad attack. Oh no. Oh actually, oh yes, because no, it's a sad attack. That's not a sad attack, that's a pretty good attack. There you go. Stopped moving, that means we killed him. Or stunned him. Oh no. Oh no no, I didn't mean to oh man, I hit I hit A one too many times. Hey, looks like we got this one. I'm gonna, I'm gonna eat me a nut cookie, cause I'm pretty sure that's also good. It's not that good. Firefly is buzzing around Flint. Yeah, sometimes enemies will do a move that doesn't do nothing, like that. Ooh, 51 experience. Sammy left a present. Inside the present was some nut bread. Yay, nut bread. We love nut bread. That's right. Tip your hat. You know, you're, you're a nice cowboy. Um, don't know if I should rephrase that or not. Oh, well, time to run. Oh, no, no, no. Oh. Is that a frog? Oh, yeah. Um, sorry, you can't save no more. I would love to save. I really would. Help! Yeah, you guys don't expect any kind of funny voices. I, yeah, I'm not good. Oh, that kid burned. And then we see that thing. And now we get to see. Um, okay. This is one of the other chimeras you fight. A flying mouse suddenly attacked. That's kind of spooky to look at. Oh no. Oh no. Um. Uh, not bread. Oh yeah, hook. All right, brute force. Um, power smash. Yeah, there we go. That's how a man does it. And there, and Flint is pretty uh, manly. Yay, we're level nine now. There we go. Um, come with me if you want to live. Mr. Flint! You took fuel into your care. Yeah, people say Chuck Norris is pretty, pretty manly, but they got nothing. He has nothing on Flint. I can say that with all confidence. He goes his house. And we're making good time. I think I could probably finish this part of the chapter I wanted to do before Kiko starts getting up and starts doing his uh, siren call. Wow. 
<laughs> I'm pitch black and covered from soot, but I'm all right. I'm alive. Oh, you're pitch black too, Mr. Flint. Thank you, Mr. Pitch Black Flint. Mr. Pitch Black Flint. I love that name. Oh, yeah. He let my dad know I'm okay. He was probably worried sick about me somewhere. I'm going to try to just run through here. Oh, nope. I didn't mean to get into a fight with that. But it's okay, it's just a yam yeah monster. Oh, fuel cure, flint on, and lend us support. Yeah. Okay. Oh, man, I just realized I forgot to grab flints. I mean, uh, I forgot to grab lighters 2x4 to use as a weapon. Good grief. I like this so nut bread. Nut bread fixes everything. Oh, oh, no, didn't mean to do that. Oh, man. Well, if I'm. <laughs> fuel picked up a rock and threw it. Notice how fuel is a lot more helpful than Thomas. That's just a sad fact. You won! Yay! Yeah, but you know, like I said, I was going through a real bad time when I first played this game. And as thanks to, you know, Mr. Toy for, you know, making this, if I probably pronounce his name horribly wrong, if I. The thing I want to do to thank him is make my own fan made mother game. I have a premise in the works, I have the characters. I just gotta, you know, figure it out and all that other fun stuff. You know, just because I wish this game came out in America. I really did. I really wish it did. You know, as for Game Boy Advance, I think this would actually it probably wouldn't have sold well here in America. Truth be told, I'll eh, go fight him anyway. Yay! I he missed. Still infinitely more helpful than Thomas. And if I'm lucky, I will get the good stick, since, you know, I messed up and we gotta get it. Get the lumber. Um, which way do we go? Oh no, I'm lost. Kid, we're gonna die here. Oh, there we go. Uh... There we go. I'm not making any jokes. None at all. <laughs> and now that just looks a little ruder. Um, I, I, I apologize. I'm not saying what I apologize for, but just, just remember, I apologize. Um, I think there's a plenty of time for that. I mean, we can get this kid safe. Oh, well. Oh, Mr. Betty has gone. I scared him away just like I always scare Raph away. Alright, Afro man. Oh, he's a drunk. Hey, Hook. Don't you know, Mr. Pitch Black Guy? Don't know you who you are, Mr. Pitch Black Guy, but thanks a million for saving fuel. Oh, you're really Pitch Black. I am so glad that guy's not in the woods, because he would probably explode like a chemical fire. <laughs> Oh, fuel, flint. You're yeah, pitch black. Yeah, we know. If you look, blah, 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 blah. Uh huh. Yeah, we'll talk to the lady. Uh, it's polite. Uh, lady? Oh, uh, Mr. Flint and fuel. You're yeah, both pitch black. Guy, blah, blah, blah. Huh? Oh, this injury? Actually, about that. <laughs> yes, this injury. Abby here was attacked by some bizarre flying mouse thing with bug wings. I just went chomp and bit her on the hand, head. If does, does that makes sense? If it didn't, I can explain to you again. It made sense to me. Same here. That's a very easy to understand explanation. 
Oh, I love this game. I love this game so much. Oh yeah, there's that other guy. Flint, <laughs> yeah, picture that we know. Being responsible, man. Nah, blah blah blah. Hurry. <laughs> Wait, see a dad's dying breath. Uh, oh, he doesn't die. I was just joking, and now I can't find him. Oh, there he is. Dad. That that voice is it? You fuel? You all right? What the? What in the world happened to you? If it's black and covered in soot. What about you, Dad? You busted your leg. Oh, this this ain't nothing. All I gotta do is twist it like so, and then <laughs> do this end, then ow, can't start it. Boss, what in the world are you doing? That's Fixing my injuries. Obviously, what does it look like? Uh, he's a tough guy. I can see him and Flint having manly contests. Anyway, we're sure you, we sure are lucky Flint showed up when he did. Yeah, when lighters, uh, blah, 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 blah. blah. Oh, yeah. Always been curling buddy since they were kids. Enough to make me jealous. Oh, Ed, you son of a gun. Kirk Flint, punch him in the bad leg. <laughs> Makes one. <laughs> I guess I'm showing my not so tough side, huh? I owe you one for today. No, it takes a big man to to give thanks and all that. I think that could be the first time I ever heard the boss thank anyone. Ah, ha, ha, you're right. <laughs> the only thing that can make this day stranger if the suddenly started pouring rain. Yeah. We'll see in the next episode. And outside of rain. Let's hope the rain puts out the fire. <laughs> he needs a tent to lighter. Head back to Tam to the village for now. Yeah, take this as an omen, everyone. I, I can't talk. I really can't talk about what's coming up. And those who've seen it, don't spoil it. There you are, Flint. You're all patched up now. Thanks, nurse. It's a good thing you and Phil so only suffered light injuries. It's been a while since Tammy. Uh, T's. T. I'm gonna make a stupid joke. Since the village last had rain. Stupid me, my stupid tongue can't talk right. <laughs> Please get some nice rest. I'll talk to you. When I heard Han Hanana and the others coming back, with the force like it is now, it won't uh, be won't the way be back dangerous. God dang it! I mean, gosh dang it! Sorry, Lissa. <laughs> Did you see those things in the fire besides those weird bugs? Talking about some suspicious people with pig-like masks on. Those bastards. I can read it because well. I don't like to curse, but I'll, I'll read it again. Those bastards. <laughs> they turn the forest pitch black. And you, Flint. You round up pitch black. Man, he is on some good medication right now. <laughs> you should get some rest now, Dad. Oh, speaking of which, I gotta call my prescription. Oh, yeah. You were pitch black too, Fuel. Come on, Dad. You really need to rest now. The old wrestling is good and ready, you little punk. <laughs> Thanks for everything. Oh yeah, blah blah blah. Oh no. Okay, good. My run my run does bend, make everything all jostled. No. Nope. Right, what do you guys have to say? I have I didn't talk to you guys the last time. 
Isaac said he was going into the mountains to pick mushrooms. Oh, I hope he's all right. Helping others, being helped by, uh, helping others out, being helped by others, uh, helping others out. Well, what do you think, Flint? Have it like? Do you like a Flint? Sure. Cheers to this rain for putting out the fire. My husband is such a wimp. He was nervous back during the fire. I was worried. I was more worried about him than the fire. That's exactly how I'm like. Hey, hey, Flint. Sorry I wasn't much help earlier. But if something ever happens again, I promise I'll help out. You must be tired. You, need, you should get some rest. Your room on the farthest end is unoccupied. Nah, I'll go home. Can't, oh, no. Flint. Perfect timing. I heard you guys were taking a rest here. Mighty heaven rain, isn't it? I think I'll join you under the awning. Flint, tell me. Have you seen Hedmana and the kids? No. I see. He's a lumber town. Actually, I was picking... I was in the mountains while you were picking mushrooms, and I was out there. I caught sight of Helena. Then, while I was taking a break by the river, I heard loud roars far off in the distance. Sounded like it might have been a drago that was roaring. After that, I heard, well, I think it might have been screams. Say, Flint, had one of the kids made it back home, right? I already have a heavy heart. I know it's coming up. You guys don't. Except for Alyssa and Jessica and Raph. Ah, good boy. Things I hardly say to dogs. Oh no, I have to read this again. It's letter from Hirana. Well, oh, there we go again, guys. Second verse, same as the first. Oh no, here we go. Dear Flint, like you said, they. Oh man, I'm not gonna bother with this again. I'm ruining the atmosphere, so I'm just gonna stay quiet until it's done. Hmm. I really should shouldn't go so Oh hey they're still not back. Oh they're still not back? With all the strength they can catch a cold. I'll go find them. I need own fuel. They'll probably be taking shelter in the rain from the rain somewhere. It's getting late, so we should go look for them. Let's get the other villagers to help too. Okay, I'll tell my dad then. I'm thinking. You know what? Hmm. It has almost been an hour. And I don't think 
Oof, oof. Please take me with you. I'll sure I'll be helpful. Yeah, let's take them. Roof, roof. Hooray! Because I like to get it out of the way. Let's see how far you go without. Let's see how far we go. We might be able to pull this off. We might not. I'm just kind of. You know, everyone's on their, you know, duty looking around. Oh, here you go. Oh, hey. Hey there. Oh, there you are, Flynn. Is everyone to split up and search for the Force for Harana? You've been blessed with kind friends. That must be true happiness in one sense. Yeah, I'll, I'll see what we can do, guys. What up, Wes? I'd like to join your search, but they told me to stay here because I'm old. Seems nobody read just how strong I really am. I like Wes. He's a cool guy. Brr, this rain's cold. I don't like it. It doesn't uh, seem to... Uh, it's like it's ever going to stop. Yeah, let's, yeah, let's just go for it, guys. Uh, let me just... Yeah, I say we go for it. I don't know. Raf came back. There we go. Good old Mr. Batty. Nice. This is going to be really hard without <laughs> listening to the music. I don't know. We got, we got his nut bread again. How does that count? Raph snuck up on me from behind, guys. Oh, no. <laughs> Hooray, level 10. Extra experience. That actually looks real tasty. Oh, please don't. Please, please. Kiko. Kiko. Go back to sleep, Kiko Mon. Go back to sleep. He, he's our min pin. It, it, he's one of the reasons why I don't record in the day. And I'm, it's like three. Like going on. Um, four in the morning. Has a. Be early, have to be up early tomorrow to call for my prescriptions. So, yeah. yeah. Let's talk to you. Don't worry, Flint. All these people looking, I'm sure we'll find them soon. Let's have some faith. Blah, blah, blah. What about you? I didn't realize it before because the flames are so intense at the time. Looks like the area over here got really bad on. F yeah, uh, okay. Oh, a snake in his cohort. A mighty body snake. Oh. Oh, this dog screwed. Okay, he's now level eight. Here's some of the kitchen. 
But this time the light's on, so no one could get the jump on me this time. I'm I'm sitting in a real lit room and I'm facing my doorway. Mom ain't gonna sneak over me this time. Oh good. Oh, oh a big yam. I thought we were gonna find the snake for a moment. Alert, Boney's low on strength. Be careful. Stupid snake. That <laughs> scary face. Oh, his defense went down. Ooh. Hot steam. And <laughs> the yeah, monster was tamed. Ooh. Man, I really want to bake yam I really want to bake yam now. Well, oh, that's perfect for B Bony. That's a bad name. I will also get one of these. Q. No, uh, we can't have a dog dying on here. People wouldn't like that. Well, we actually snuck up on one. I didn't think that was possible. Let's get him from behind. Hey guys, why are you behind me? That's what he was thinking. Oh man, like this video right now is uh, 10 gigabytes large. Is it still recording? Please tell me it is. Yeah. Oh no. Okay, it is. <laughs> that scared me, guys. I don't like getting scared. Okay, we were right behind that snake. Look at that. Derpy little jerk. You know, if I had a mongoose or a ferret right now, this snake would be wasted. No, Kiko. No. Kiko, please don't. This is the only time I could record. Please don't. Please be quiet. Watch your step. That's easy to lose fruiting and step around here. Ah, huh, mouse. Squeak, squeak, squeak. This house I was secretly living in burned down. Oh, that's sad. Poor little mouse. Guess I have no choice but to hit the road. Poor little guy. Um, uh, I guess I went the wrong way. Oh, yeah, I. And the dogs are now being let loose to go outside. They have been surprisingly quiet. Come on, we're right behind it. There we go, that's how we do it. I like ferrets. Ferrets make me smile. Oh, wait a second, I'm an idiot. Yeah, whatever, you monsters. Uh. <laughs> I blame the I blame that guy with the funny hair. Oh yeah, we gotta worry about this guy first. Q. Made a scary face. <laughs> that would be kind of cool to have, you know. I I, I might have to break out the Instamorph and try to make a big monster. I like to sculpt things with Instamorph. It's a meldable plastic that you heat up with boiling hot water. I just charged that snake head on. Oh man. 
Oh, I just got. Oh, only Flynn got poisoned. You know, he. He's tough. Oh, that's. She looks like Pokey Mitch's mom from Earthbound. Or Mother 2, if you like. I don't know. I don't know what you guys like. I don't know what anyone likes. It's because I'm a bad person that way. <laughs> Alright, what's going on here? Oh no. One of the fathers lives right up here, but. Um. Actually, it looks like someone went here and snapped these trees in half. Not lightning. That can't be possible. Mmm. I can't believe my eyes. Just look at this, Flint. These two trees snapped right into you. How could such big trees get ripped down like this? There's one thing for sure. Whatever did this, was it wasn't human. And no, it wasn't me? I don't know how to interpret that. Um, the only thing that comes to my mind is something bad. I don't want to say it. What do we do now? The path is complete. They have that path completely blocked. Actually, Hirana and the kids might be stuck out there because of all these knockdown trees blocking the way. Even if it's not the most direct path, we should find another way around. It's probably best if we split up into a few groups. What's that guy's problem? The, the one with kind of like the, oh, he just walked away. That guy. Hey. Hey, guys, I got a cough real quick. <clears throat> Have you found Hirana and the kids yet? Lighter. Are you sure you're in a good enough shape to be out here? I'm always in good enough shape. Don't treat me like some injured clod. These two are going to have a man off. We'll take care of things here. Keep pushing on ahead, Flint. You know, like, look, I'm not the kind of guy that picks apart things in games, but if it was me, I could just step over the smallest part, go around that rock, and keep going up. Okay, right, no, can I steal that? Please? I want that. No, no, uh, give me that. Uh, I want lighter. Lighter, can I have it? No, alright. Well, fine, be like that. I'm just going to stay here poisoned. Hope Hermana's alright. I'm gonna try this again, please. Unable to save. I wonder what's going on. Oh well. To the next rock. Man, I am dying. All the forest critters have been are acting weird. I'm suddenly getting real bad vibes here. Oh no, I mean that in a good way. What? What I mean to say is I'm getting good bad vibes, if that makes sense. Thump thump. Okay. I guess it's just a guess, but I'd say a dragon climbed up here from here. See see those color marks? It's almost certainly belong to a dragon. But why would a dragon claw <laughs> at stuff like this. Enough to leave gashes and rock even. They're such peaceful creatures. I get the bad feeling something I get the feeling something's very bad. It's happening to the forest, the people and the animals and me. No problem here. Uh-oh. What is it, boy? What is it, Boney? What is it? Flint. I think Boney found something. Such a weird name for a dog. Then I guess Kikomon is kind of weird if you think about it. Oh, look up there. 
There's a scrap of cloth. Do you see it? It's a bit red. Right over there. Pan upward and we see that. Oh good, here's Wes. What is it? Is there something on top of this cliff? <laughs> old man Wes, what are you doing here? Sorry to say, but there's nothing a rickety old man can do to help us out. Or is there? <coughs> Sorry guys. Oh, Flint, don't tell me you intend to climb this cliff. I'm gonna. I just know how I feel, but scaling this cliff face is too dangerous. But you know what? Maybe my son could be of use. I don't know if he'll will help any. Well, let's get him he, so he can try. <laughs> I need to borrow Boney for a bit. <laughs> Boney, bring my son back here. His name is a strange but nice guy with unexpected skills. Don't care. His name is Duster. His name is Duster. Got that? Here, sniff out the sock. Yeah, that's ripe. <laughs> Gross. Don't forget the smell now. Ripper. <laughs> it's alright. That's ripe, alright. See, the original time I played is actually named him after me because. Oh, yeah, I've tied a yellow ribbon on your collar. Which. Show him the ribbon and he'll know exactly what's going on. Now fetch. Now when I first oh wait. Fru Fru Fee, count on me. Now when I first played this game, you know, I was getting sciatica, so I would walk with a real bad limp. So I, I decided to name Dust after me when I first played through. It was nice. Go Bony, go! Get that stinky thief. Stinky as in his socks are always ripe and bad smelling. And poor dental hygiene and all the other fun stuff. He, he's a good thief. He's the thief of justice. Funny thing is, this is how I sleep when dogs are around. I just pass out. I don't care that barking. <laughs> oh, that's funny. No dog, could, uh, no dog could drag me, though. <laughs> oh, there he goes. Duster, at long last, it is time to put your thief skills you've studied since childhood to the test. Now show us your wall uh, staple technique. Right there, right now. Right here, right now. I did study that technique, but this is my first time using it for real. Well, if it works. This area looks scalable. <laughs> That's cool. See, the, the interesting thing about Duster is he does not have any Psy abilities. He actually has his uh, thief tools. Alright, that should do it. Flint, be careful climbing up. Oh yeah, I'm still poisoned. I was hoping that would cancel it out. Um, okay, looks like the rain stopped. I have a slight leg handicap, but I'll do my best. Please take me with you. Darn straight, we'll take it. We're taking you with us. Let's <laughs> join your party. The same color as Hirana's dress. Got a scrap of cloth. Now we're gonna take uh I'm gonna take a bake yam. Oh, 
oh wait, I have an antidote. Where did I get this? I'm just going to use a nut bread. That raft was nice enough to give me. Hey Flynn, there's someone here. What are those? Are they human? Come on guys, that's inappropriate to put your arms up like that. What are they doing? That's the, where the Nazi thing comes in. <coughs> No. <laughs> oh, why the caribou? Oh, the humanity. The reconstructed caribou suddenly attacked. Alright. So if I remember how to do... Oh, wait, no, no, no. If I remember how to do this... We're gonna do that. We're gonna do this. And then we're gonna do this. Yeah. This should hold him down for a couple of turns. Just like that. We're gonna power smash. And we're gonna kick him in the face, and we're gonna bite him in the face. Ah, uh, dang it! You had one job. Out oh here. Oh man, that sounded painful. In case you guys missed that, it said that he. Uh, Stabbed, I think he stabbed Flint with his antlers. But I wonder which one. <laughs> this thing uh, can get captured a lot with the. Uh, oh man, that's horrible. A burst of steam. Oh, I guess it didn't do nothing. I was expecting, like, you know, like burning someone's face off. Hooray! Oh man, I guess, he is, I guess he's already toughened up. Or strengthened up. He can't move. I'm just gonna beat up this moose. Oh dear. Reconstructive and caribou went berserk. Well, that was mean. Oh dear. Oh, I'm starting to. Oh, there goes Boney. Alright. Unfortunately, we don't have anything to bring back, Boney, so he doesn't get no points. And then I panicked. Oh, there we go. Hooray! The reconstructed caribou stopped moving. You won! Flint and Company earned 112 experience points. I guess they put that thing out of its misery. Lying on the ground is a new book with a pig nose like mark on the cover. Give it a read? Yes. Flynn picked up the new book and read it. The following was written in poor handwriting. Older creatures around here suck. We need to make them cooler. So the theme will be tougher, rougher, better. We'll mix and match this and that to create a whole new things no one's ever seen before. I'm dubbing it the Fascinating Chimera Project. Let's reconstruct and modify. Oh man, this stuff is horrible. <laughs> Slowly and steadily. Got the pig mark notebook. I think we go up here, we'll watch them escape.
I like Duster. He's a cool guy. An incredibly suspicious object to what anyone's guess is as to what it is. I didn't read, read that right, but I don't care. I think, therefore I am. I'm glad the thief arts <laughs> provide useful, but our problem still hasn't been solved. It wouldn't seem so cold. Actually, my I'm actually burning up though. That's probably hyperthermia, bud. Brr, so cold. I hope Piranha ha ha choo doesn't catch a cold too, Sniffle. Flint. We found the kids. They fell into the river and washed up here. I'll look after Boney. You hurry up and see them. Come on, Boney. What's this guy's problem? Piranha's a wonderful person. Uh, so I'm sure God will look out for her. Flint, we found the children. We did it! We did it, Flint. With everyone working together, there's nothing we can't do. Oh, <laughs> now you say that. He slapped him hard. I felt that. I'm sure Hiranna is taking shelter from the rain somewhere. This forest would never do anything to hurt the people of uh, T Village. <laughs> if anyone ever uh, dares to hurt Hirana, I'll kick their butts. Even if it's a pill bug or an ant, man, you're a bully. Yeah, that, you deserve that one. No mercy, basically. Don't bow to me, I'll kill both of you. Oh, Flint and Duster. This way, this way. Man, Flint can run with the best of them. I'm gonna talk to these people first. We haven't found Harana yet, but for sure we'll keep the... You should uh, warm yourself up by the fire. If you keep this up, you'll run off worse than her. Oh, I guess I... Alright. Dad. Ah. I made some in a tea, Flint. Please have some. I'll warm you up. Here, everyone else should take a break and get warmed too. Ah, oh, that's so nice. Thank goodness they're okay. What a relief. Oh, yeah. Yeah, huh? It seems they both fell in the river and got washed downstream. Poor little things. I wonder where Klaus and Lucas fell into the river. In any case, I'm just glad they're okay. I wonder what they'll get to eat when their mom gets back. I hope she comes back soon. I guess he saw him found Hirana. Uh, where the heck could she be? Dad. Flint! Flint, I'm not sure what to say, but just stay calm and hear me out. I have good news and I have bad news. Which you want to hear first? No, let me start with the good news first. I picked a giant dragon thing. Don't make a, it'll make for a great weapon. I figured you could probably use it. 
As for the bad news, the bad news is it's where I found the Drago Fang. It was in your. It was pierced through your wife's heart. That is sad. You know, like if I if I was Flint, I'd probably be doing the same thing. Flint, just try to stay calm. I think the only reason Klaus and Lucas are safe and sound now is because Hirana risked her life to protect them. Flint. Flint. Flint, I'm not sure what to say. Please try to pull yourself together. Flint, what are you doing? Klaus and Lucas are watching. Yeah, guys, uh, this game does deal with pretty heavy stuff like that. Uh, my timer hasn't moved. I Okay, there it is. <laughs> I was almost mad for a moment. Well, it has always been like that. Uh-oh. Well, I'm not going to worry now. But, yeah, this game does deal with some pretty heavy stuff like that. And we're coming up to the point we're about to leave off. No one's ever been throwing uh, Tazmili Jello before. You have the honor of being the first. Flint, he gave Ollie and Abbott a real walloping, but they're all right now. About Hidwana. I can only offer my deepest condol condolences. So, why would a Drago attack someone? That they're such friendly creatures. Take it easy here, in here for a while. I know you guys must have had a hard time, but try and get some sleep. The Drago fang that was stuck in Hirana's chest, I'll hold on to it for you. When you get out of here, uh, come and drive by my house and get it. Don't forget now. And I think we'll just call it here. Yeah, I mean, it. This game does become an emotional roller coaster. You'll have some fun times, and we'll hit times like this. And this isn't going to be the first sad moment. Um. Secondly, if you're going to give someone bad news like that, never do good news, bad news to them. Because I know it sucks, but you've, sometimes you've got to pour it all out. 
Because I think bad news, good news will probably get you punched in the face. If that. Anywho, guys. Um, I hope we'll have a good ride on this journey. I love this game. It really helped me out in some of my darkest times. And it's going to be an emotional roller coaster. I, as you can tell, I had to fight back from tearing up a bit there. So, um, you guys have a wonderful day. I don't know when I'm going to post this up. I know it's going to take a long time for it to convert into a smaller file and all that. I'm talking to making it go longer. Um, I'm really happy that I get to do this. And everyone have a good day and or night. And with that, I'm off.